An after school program is giving local kids some in depth experiences that they would normally get in the classroom. Our Larry Sprinkle shares how a group of kids are learning how to keep their smiles bright. Who knows why you go to the dentist? Raise your hand. It's a lesson kids can really sink their teeth into. And we expose them to opportunities that, you know, they typically just don't get. That's the mission of the after school program offered by an organization called Raise a Child of the Carolinas. They want to expose children from grades K through 12 to educational opportunities they wouldn't see on a regular basis. Lessons that cover the basics of science, engineering, math, reading, and technology. We try to make sure that they're getting those opportunities and applying them to real life situations. February is National Children's Dental Health Month, and today's lesson is all about the mouth. They're talking about dental hygiene and introducing the older kids to professionals in the dental field, people who have made this a career. So often when you talk to, especially black and brown youth, um, when you ask them, you know, what do they want to be when they grow up, they can only tell you what they're exposed to. They can only tell you what they see on a normal basis. And you often get basketball player, rapper, they, you, they, you're only going to get what they see. So it's important for us to give them opportunities beyond what they're seeing on a daily basis so that they know that the, the sky is the limit. Raise a Child is primarily in the Sugar Creek Corridor, partnering with the Sugar Creek Charter School. They're currently serving over 100 children, giving them opportunities to see and learn. I learned how to brush your teeth and how long you need to brush your teeth and how um, your teeth get unhealthy and healthy. Lessons they can put to use every day. I learned that bad food is not good for your teeth because it will make your teeth not healthy and you will get cavities. For these students, it's a chance to brush up on skills they'll need for the rest of their lives. In North Charlotte, Larry Sprinkle, back to you. And you can get involved with Raise a Child of the Carolinas by volunteering or donating. And as a reminder, if you know of any organizations in the area doing great work that you'd like for us to highlight, send us the details at newstips at wcnc.com.